Welcome back. We are here again on the Unorthoblox server. I'm just floating around over here by the dive shop. This thing was looking a bit plain, so I uh, decided to add a small coral reef here right out uh, front to give the divers something to look at as they're heading out to sea. Okay, let's see. Nope, no one wants to go diving yet. So I did a little bit more landscaping around the area. So this edge over here by the sign, it was just like just plain dirt drop off. So I put this uh, low wall here and this moss carpet on top of it and it looks a lot nicer. So I added in this guy fishing, uh, looking at a spyglass, eating lunch. And then to the focus of today's episode, these goats. So I need to get them out of the cafe and put them in their own little spot. So I have this area over here and if I clean it all up, I think this would be a great place to add a goat pin to keep them all in one spot and out of the eating area so they're not bothering any of the patrons. Now I do need to apologize to Sunny Spacecraft. I uh, blamed her for putting the goats in my cafe when it was actually Travis Sets Fire who did that. Although Sunny is not totally innocent because she is raising a goat army. Uh, I have a feeling she's planning to uh, take over the server with an army of goats and these are just scouts preparing for the invasion. So I'm going to keep the pen uh, rather small. I don't need a huge amount of animals, but I do want it to be large enough so they're not going to keep trying to escape, if that is possible. These guys seem to want to go wherever they want to go. So first up, I need to get rid of all this mycelium. And I want to replace everything with grass. Um, I don't think the goats actually eat, eat the grass, but it will look much better to have a gr green pin instead of this funny purplish gray look. Now I think it would actually be reasonable if you could shear goats to get wool. Not dye them like you would a sheep, but just get white wool whenever you shear a goat. And not as often, you know, it wouldn't, they wouldn't reproduce it as much. Just sort of a minor source for wool. I mean, people do, you know, use goat wool or goat hair for stuff. So I am going to line uh, the edge of the pin with uh, this cobbled uh, deep slate. And then the gate is going to be right here. So like I said, uh, the interior is going to be grass. That is a bright green. I kind of like that. Ooh, it's getting dark. Okay, let me go see if I can get some sleep so we can actually see what's going on around here. Well, I forgot that you still can't sleep in this dimension. And I'm too lazy to go all the way over to the portal to get into the other world. So we are going to want to light things up around here. Not really for mob protection, but just for uh, visibility and ambiance. And I think the uh, moss carpet is perfect for hiding lighting now. Um, it's much more believable than the normal just green carpeting was because it's got all this different textures and stuff. I 
Okay, that is much better. So I'm putting a fence uh, around everything. And then on the corners uh, for decoration, I'm adding the uh, stone block or the wall blocks. And then uh, kind of an arch gate here to finish everything up. So in the arch, I want to go up just enough so it's uh, comfortable and looks good. And then cap it off right about here. Yeah, I think, I think that looks good. So over here, I'm going to add uh, some path in here. If uh, the server lag is letting me. And then let's see, okay, maybe if I add in a fence, no, that is not going to work. Okay. I was going to add a lantern hanging off the arch, but that's not going to happen because the fence and the walls will not join up. Yeah, so I'm just going to bury a light source here under the moss and that should finish the path. So I think I am going to run around a bit. No, no. I want to uh, add a fence to all the corner posts. So I, I want to, because I'm going to hang some lanterns from chains all around the pin. You know, instead of just hiding all the light under Mars Cop the moss uh, carpet there. I think I want the pin to have a bit of elevation. So adding these tall lamp posts in here kind of, you know, elevates it a bit and makes it look much better. You know, the lighting is really for design, not for lighting the area up. I just think it looks good that way. Just a couple more of these. Oh, come on, I want to get it up high enough. That way you're not tempted to hit your head on them. There we go. Oh, I think, oh, it looks like daylight's coming. That'll be nice. You actually see stuff. So we just kind of finish this up, a couple more lamps, and I think the pin is done. Yeah, I like the way that looks. So the final piece of this puzzle is to move these noisy goats out of here and into their new home. Okay. Come on guys, let's go, let's go. Come on over here. Oops, oh. Hey, don't, no, don't jump up there. Come on, get through the gate. 
Get through the gate. Wow, you guys are going to be difficult with this. Okay, one at a time now. Come on, you go through. And you, okay. All right now, okay. Get over here. Okay, now, there you go. Get in, get in there. You guys stay here and enjoy your new home. That screaming is going to get on my nerves. See, that's, that's normal. Normal sounding. Oh! And they're still jumping. Yeah, and you stay in there. Stay. Don't go anywhere. Get down off of there. Get down. Oh, no, no. Don't do it. Don't. Don't do that. Keeping them off of stuff is definitely going to be a problem. Well, I guess we'll just let them do what they need to do. Oh, screaming. Well, that is a picture to take right there. Okay, now I've got my photo. I think I want to say uh, we are done today. Thank you all for watching. If you want to see what else is going on on the server, please look in the description below and it will have links to... It'll have links to everybody's uh, video channels where you can watch their videos. So for now, have a great day and I will catch you later. Bye bye. They are just not going to stay in that pen. Oh! Well, they like the jump, don't they?